Um, <laughs> I intend to stay with Tesla as, as far into the future as I can imagine. Um, and uh, there are a lot of exciting things that we have coming. Uh, we've got um, obviously the Model 3 that's coming soon. Uh, we'll be unveiling the uh, Tesla semi truck. Um, and okay, maybe... well, we're going we're to come yeah. to this. So, okay. so, so Model 3, so it's, coming, it's supposed to be coming in July ish. Yeah, it's looking quite good for starting production in July. Yeah. Wow. Um, one of the things that people are so excited about is, is the fact that it, it's, um, it's got autopilot. And um, you, you put out this video a while back showing what that, um, what that technology looked sure. like or would look like. Yeah. Um, there's obviously autopilot in Model S right now. Yeah. Well, what are we seeing here? Yeah, so this is um, using only cameras and a GPS. So there's no LiDAR or radar being used here. This is just using passive optical, which is essentially what a person uses. Um, the, the whole road system is meant to be navigated with uh, passive optical or, or cameras. And so once you solve cameras uh, or vision, uh, then autonomy is solved. If you don't solve vision, it's not solved. So that, that's why our focus is so heavily on having a, a vision neural net that's very effective for road conditions. Right. Many other people are going the LiDAR route. You, you want cameras plus radar is, is most of it. You can absolutely be superhuman with just cameras. Hmm. Like you could probably do 10 times better than humans with just, just cameras. So, so the new cars being sold right now have, have uh, eight, eight cameras in them. That, yeah. that they, they can't yet do what that showed. Um, when will they be able to? Um, I think the, we're still on track for being able to go um, cross-country from LA to New York by the end of the year, fully autonomous. Um, and okay, so, so, so a car, by the end of the year, you're saying yeah. that someone's going to sit in a Tesla without touching the steering wheel, tap in New York, mm -hmm. off it goes, yeah. won't have to ever touch the wheel by the end of 2017. Yeah, essentially. November this, or December of this year, we should be able to go from, yeah, all the way from a parking lot in California to a parking lot in New York. No controls touched at any point during the entire journey. And <laughs> Amazing. But part of that is possible because you've already got a fleet of Teslas driving all these roads. You're, you're, yeah. you're accumulating a huge amount of data mm -hmm. of that national mm -hmm. road system. Yes. But the thing that will be interesting is that I, I, I'm, I'm actually fairly confident it will be able to do that route um, even if you change the route dynamically. 